one of the things that I'm noticing more and more in my own life and also in the projects that I'm doing is that what people really want is uh, a trusted voice. They want someone else who they know to, 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 sh to give them advice. They say, I'm trying to buy a flat panel TV or my, I, the other day I had to buy a cell phone from my mother who's 85. And so on my Facebook page I put up, I've been you know, struggling to find a phone that my mom can use that she can understand, she can't remember things very well. And to my astonishment, within about 20 minutes, I had 15 people telling me not just what phone, but about their mothers or their fathers and what they went through and the mistakes they made. So I sort of held my hand up in cyberspace, as we used to call it, and suddenly I had all these people, many of whom I knew, some I didn't. And the people I knew, I trusted more because I know them and I or to trust their judgment. But the ability of technology to connect me in real time to trusted sources of information is much more valuable than an ad or a review on a, on a website because I never know, you know, if there's some other agenda, if someone's paid them, if they're getting, you know, paid for mentioning that particular product. So I think that, that that's going to be become more and more important to people of, of who you trust and who you get your information from. Uh, one of the things that also I find really interesting is the ability to do this in real time. That, you know, I have a question, I'm in a store, I want to know right now, I'm, I, I was, you know, I'm with my mother today, I, I can't come back two weeks from now, I need that information immediately. So the, the fact that I have access to this peer group, and in some cases I don't know who has the answer, but, but, but anybody who does, I mean, people now seem to be very, People, are, I think, get a great amount of satisfaction out of helping other people, especially your friends, because you want them to help you back. Um, so in terms of how this is disruptive, it means that the traditional sources that people used to rely on, you know, the, I, I still believe in consumer reports, but I want consumer reports and I also want to find out from a friend who actually used that product or service. The thing that excites me the most right now about the technology that we, that's in, in our lives is products that can morph and change where I have one product, but then there's new software, there's new upgrades, where the product itself, I don't have to keep buying a different version of that product. It keeps getting better. That, that there are cool things I didn't know I could do two days ago. And that um, it's, it's like, it feels like it's magic. I mean, I have such a sense of delight out of this device that every day I love it more and more. And I, and I think more and more of the devices in our lives are gonna become like that, where they can basically learn from us instead of us having to learn how to use them we can actually say, I wish it did this, and two days later, a brilliant programmer has made it do that. I love that. I think it just, it, it gives you such a sense of, it's, it's really, it feels, it's, it's akin to magic.